So today in this video, I'm going to redesign the UI of the application. So hello, so my name is Devendra. And if you want the Figma file for this project, then you can visit our website astro.shop. Here you will get the premium quality UI kit. And if you are the designer and if you also want to publish your Figma kit, then you also can do this. Just visit the astro.shop, then click on the publish now button and start publishing your application and start your earning. So, so without any ado, let's start today's video. So first thing first, let me introduce myself. I'm Devendra Koi, UI designer. If you want to connect with me, then here's my email ID, Devendra Koi 41 at gmail.com. Or else if you want to connect me on the telegram, then here's my telegram ID that is Devendra Koi 41. Or else if you want to connect with me on WhatsApp, then here's my WhatsApp number as well. If you are interested to download the free version of this UI kit, then you will get this free version on my Figma community profile. The link of the Figma community profile have been given in the description box. So I have not uploaded it, but once I done the shooting, then I will upload this UI kit on my Figma community profile as well. Or else if you want the paid version of this UI design kit, then you can purchase this from airstore.shop. So let's jump to the screen screen. So this is the screen page and below that you can see here the asset page. So I have not created any variable style and the assets for the typography or color. So let me tell you which font I have been used for this project. So I have been used the pop-in font font and if you ask me which color you have been used. So I have been used the bluish darkish color. So before going ahead let me show you how I designed this screen section. So this is a splash screen. This is the home screen I have been created. Here you can see the how glossy screen I have been created. And here is the player screen. If user uh, click here on the full screen then this uh, player will get open and if user switch this to the shot then this screen will get uh, open and after user click on the search then here on search they can see the history section as well as suggested section like the trending music news and share market and the, all the things that user are interested in then here is the search page and then i have been created the profile screen like this way here i have been keep the google sign in and here will be the profile or channel profile of the user and below that the name of the user below is a user id and something like this i have been created and below that i have been created the premium sections okay so this is a youtube premium I have been created very glossy and very minimalistic uh, when user click on the Google account then this will something look like this uh, when user click on the your videos this list will look like this uh, when user click on the my download section then my download section is looking like this so here is an option like the film section so that's why I have been created uh, two extra screen for the film so this will be the bonus for the paid user so if you want to the purchase this UI design kit then you will get this UI design on airstore.shop here I have been uploaded many UI designs so if you want then you can visit the airstore.shop so this is the overview of our UI design kit. Those who want to learn more about this UI design kit, then this video is for them. So now I'll share some tips and, and tricks about the UI design that I have been used for this project. So what I'm doing, I'm redesigning a UI of the existing application that are very famous. If you want, then please subscribe to the channel as well as share this video with your friends because I am sharing the UI design tip by redesigning the existing application. So why I choose a dark bluish color? The reason behind is that, so if you take a look on the idea of the YouTube, then it's something like the video streaming application means user will come and watch the video uh, so this color I picked this color randomly okay uh, I was just searching moving around this uh, cursor so I got this color okay uh, then afterward what I did I just dragged the logo over this splash screen so this is my splash screen and why I choose this black dark color and dark theme so so before selecting any color you should understand what your application is to whom you are making application for okay so if your application is a video streaming platform or the movie streaming platform or something else then you should go with the dark theme and if your application is something like the education application then you should go with the light theme okay so next let's move to the home screen so here you can see i have been created a switches for the youtube and the short because the youtube is other thing and the short is other things that's why this thing is coming in my mind we should create the toggle button for the youtube as well as the short okay so that's why i've been created here the toggle and just behind that i have been placed the white youtube logo oh, so that's the logic behind using this toggle button here you can see i have been uh, created the place for uh to display the ads okay so here i've been created this component like this way so here if you uh, take a look then i have been created the two types of button one is the primary button and another is a tertiary button so what is primary button if you want to be more focus on in the specific button so like the shop now is our primary goal of this ad so, so what i've been done i have been kept this shop now as a primary button and below that i have been the tertiary button that is a watch without background uh, and here i have been placed the ad so user can get this is the ad why i keep the white background for this advertisement because the, if you take a look on the youtube or business model then it's something like if you keep the background color white then the more center of focus is going on the ad when you open the youtube application so below that i have been created uh, the list view uh, so this is something like our list view will be 
took likes and below that i have been keep only three section one is upload another is profile and another is search and rest all thing i have been moved in something else so next screen is watch screen okay so here you can see i have been uh, redesigned the whole watch screen something like this so here you can see i have been adjust a title from here to here okay and the timeline of the video will get visible on the slider and here uh, i have been placed the full screen and uh, uh, full screen and automatic screen what we called okay icon over here and the, on the top of that i have been created the cast of the screen left side share uh, share icon at the left side and the comment at the left side and on the right side i have been keep the setting option and below the screen i have been keep the like and dislike and here i have been keep the arrow so if you want to watch more video and when they drag this slider then the all the other videos will get visible okay so this is how the idea behind using the watch screen so let's jump to the next screen that is the short video so i have been created a short video screen something like this okay i just move up the title from here bottom to the top just near to the title i have been placed the icon and below the title i have been kept uh, the username of the creator and here i have been kept the search icon so the like dislike comment and share option i have been keep something like the youtube have that already and below that i have been keep the subscribe button and just behind that i have been keep the music option and below that here you can see the which music i have been used uh that title will be get visible and here same the slider option means there is something to the next video so if you take a look on the search screen so uh, i have been created a different list for the search view uh, on the top of that there is a channel name and below that the thumbnail and title of the video because we really don't matter to show uh, the views in the history okay so then then next thing uh, the suggested section so when you open the application of the youtube then you might see the if you now open the youtube application then you can see uh, this here on the home screen like in the chip view in the chips you are design okay i just created these features on the search screen the next screen i have been created that is search screen so here you said can search uh, or they on uh, and the next thing is that i have been created for the profile so here nothing is special so if you take a look here on the premium so that's my main basically thing is i have been kept the profile icon over here and just near that i have been kept the google icon so if anyone want to switch their google id then they can switch easily and below that i have been kept the name of the user and user id and here i have been kept the three option like your videos download and your movies and just bottom of the that i have been make the more focus on the youtube premium because the youtube premium is the one of the business model of the youtube so that's why what i did i just make the more center focus on the youtube premium and i make it bigger okay so that's why what user can do when user click on the profile then uh, they will get more focus on the premium than over here so if you take a look on the youtube application then they have been created the youtube premium below the ua movies okay so but here you can see the more focus when user open the profile screen then the more of the focus going to the get youtube premium tab so that's the reason i have been created the premium tab something like this you can bring up this from the here to the home screen as well okay that's your choice uh, then the next thing is the youtube premium screen so i have been created a youtube premium screen uh, something like this okay uh, then next thing is a google account so you can see google logo and just near that i have been created a ad logo so if you want to add a uh, new gmail id then you, then they can easily uh, do that okay and just below that they can see the logged in email id and below that i have been kept the button to manage the account and below that i have been created the tertiary button that is the, that is for learn more about this account okay uh, so let's jump to the next screen that is the your video screen so here you can see my your video screen uh, so here i have been created the title bar and i have been kept the back button as well as the title of the screen so the screen name is your video and i have been kept this title to the center of the screen okay simple easy and just below that i have been created a list and the design of the list is very different uh, from the all the list that i have been created for this project here i have been kept the main focus on the edit and the tertiary focus on the deletes okay so the next screen is uh, my download screen so same here i have been created title and here i have been created a different list so if so i have been created a different list for each screen so if you take a look on this design then this design very different from this from this from this as well okay then the next screen is a film section so what i did i just created a new logo for the youtube films i know this is not looking good but i have been create for kaam chalao okay and here i have been kept the search icon and here i have been created the popular movies tab 
and just below that are being created the uh, horizontal list design for the prime time movies and if you the click on the any of the movie then this screen will get visible uh, next screen is a film preview screen so here you can see have uh, been kept uh, the play icon over the poster so if user come and if user want to uh, read about this movie then they can uh, scroll down but and below that they can see the name of the movie the imdb rating the rate, uh, users rating as well as uh, genre of the movie as well as the description and the more prime time movie for you or else here you can display the related movies uh, to the horror thriller and drama so this is how our youtube design look like so i hope you like the design so if you want a free version then you will get this on the figma community i already redesigned the paper ui as well and if you like the video then please hit the like button as well as subscribe to the channel till then be happy keep designing